Dude, what you stalking? A sonic whirling assault lashing the ear with its wailing teenage angst-driven fury. Whoa, is that good? Who knows, I'm too scared to listen to it. Hey Wyatt, what's the name of that new album that you were playing last night? Back Off My Chow by Dog Toy. All right, thanks. No tacos allowed in the store, Jude. Mm. Wet taco. <laughs> <laughs> nice, very nice. Dude, are you all right? Uh, of course I am. Why wouldn't I be? Every time that Serena chick shows up, you do something stupid. I do not. I found it. <sighs> like that? All right, so I really like her. I mean, you know, we've gone out for coffee a couple times, and then there was Valentine's Day, but she's a year older than me. Dude, what are you waiting for? Go and ask her out again. I don't know. Maybe those were just like pity dates. Not even dates, more like pity coffee. I think she's way out of my league. Dude, you're wigging out. You've just got to show her you can be mature and refined, too. This coming from a guy who threw up in his girlfriend's mouth. Life begins after school. That's when we bend all the rules. Time to hang with all my friends. We like to be together in a place where we belong. I'm 16, starting to find my way. Got a new job, gonna start at the mall today. Thank God I'm on my own for the first time. I'm 16, life is sweet when you're growing up so fast. You gotta make the good times last. Sixteen, sixteen. Gotta make the good times last. No way! Duh! I am so there! Are you crazy? It's only the opportunity of a lifetime. Later! <laughs> Hey, I have the best news! You are looking at the soon-to-be newest greeter goddess at Albatross and Finch! Nice! So they hired you! Oh no, not yet. You have to go through a very rigorous interview process. It starts today. Aren't the staff there a bit stuck up? Sure, but wouldn't you be? It's like the best job in the mall. Really? Well, as long as you're still schlepping lemons, slide me a large swirly. You only order those when you get fired or dumped. I got fired from Engrave This. Cause my spelling sucks. Did you know there was a T in Christmas? Um, yeah. Maybe I should come try out too. Now that I'm out of a job, again. No offense, but I don't think you're Albatross and Finch material. Says who? The greeter gods are like a secret society. They almost never let in outside members. Only legacies. Okay, what's a legacy and why aren't I one? It means the jobs are handed down from generation to generation based on the presumption that coolness is in the genes. That's it? Well, look no further, people. Ain't nothing but coolness in these genes. Ah, <sighs> okay, fine. Come if you want to. See you out front in an hour. Oh, yeah. What's up? Hey, on your break? No, just bored. <sighs> Me too. Hey, wanna mess with Coach Halder? Definitely. So, what's it gonna be, sport? Well, the leather is quite nice to the touch, but then the plastic one is cheaper. <sighs> well, you've got five seconds left on the clock to make that call. Step up to the plate, mister. Throw the pass. Take <laughs> <laughs> that was the funniest thing I have ever seen. Did you hear him scream? Oh, yeah. <laughs> like a little girl. <laughs> Got any more ideas? <laughs> what are you kidding? Okay, I'm gonna need a fishing pole, a dollar bill, and some 50 pound line. Ladies? Hey, Jonesy! Wyatt wants to ask Serena out, but he's scared because she's way too mature for him. Dude, just take control of the situation. Show her you're a man. You don't get it. Every time I try to talk to her, I... Turn into a wuss? Something like that. All right, I've had enough of this. Yo, Serena, could you come over here for a minute? Hey! What are you doing? 
Here she comes. Don't blow it. Did you call me, Wyatt? I, uh, I... Is something wrong, Wyatt? I wanted to talk to you because I, I, uh, really like you. Oh, <gasps> oh man, he blew it. Totally choked. I like you too, Wyatt. Really? Well, now that we've gone out a few times, I just wondered... Uh... Go in for the kill. Do it, dude. I was wondering if you'd consider maybe, uh, being... Being... Boyfriend and girlfriend. With me. Wyatt, I really like you, but... Oh! I'm kind of older than you. Only by a year. I'm practically in college. I only have eight credits left to go. I'm going to college, too. One day. I just think... I'm out of my high school boy phase. I need a more mature guy who can understand my needs, you know? I'm sorry. Can we just be friends? Sure. No problem. Well, that sucked. Crashed and burned, huh, dude? That would sum it up, yeah. Dude, that was pathetic! Would you maybe consider wah, wah, wah? You've gotta sell what you've got! Yeah, dude, you've got a good package. I think you mean I've got the whole package. <sighs> What's the use? Well, if you're giving up on this hottie, I feel it's my duty to take my shoddy. The Poet Laureate speaks. Hey, babe. Yes? I understand a mature woman like yourself would seek someone more refined, but you have so much to offer a young guy such as myself. Oh, really? Think of it. You could help nurture an unformed soul. <laughs> oh, nurturing. Yes. That's what I wanted to do Saturday night. Why would you want some over-the-hill frat boy when you could have an adoring young stud on your arm who's at your beck and call every Saturday night? Look away, dude. Just look away. I can't believe I'm saying this, but you're actually making sense. Think of us as eager little puppies. We're easily trainable. That's true. So, are we on tonight, Shorty? Wyatt? I've changed my mind about us. Meet me after our shift and we'll give it a shot, okay? Oh, yeah. Who's the man, huh? Cool, dude. She wasn't my type anyway. Yeah, I think she digs smart guys. Hey! Finally! Where have you been? Scoring Wyatt a date, then the hot dog stand. Ready? Mm. Oop. Gotcha. Mmm. <sighs> This is so huge. By tomorrow, I could be just like them. What, bored? No, beautiful and popular. These clothes look like someone else already wore them. Yeah, that's the idea. They're vintage wash. Well, excuse me. Just seems kind of dumb. Shh. If I wanted used clothes, I'd... Would you shut up? Let's just get to the auditions. Let's just get to the auditions. I can't believe it. Your abs are ripped, dude. You're up. This is it. Hey, good luck, dude. I hope he takes rejection well. Okay, I've been working on my facial expressions. The bored smirk. The aloof stare. Oh, I felt that one. Totally. And how about the hoodies are in the back sneer? I don't get what the big deal is. I mean, it's just a store. <gasps> he suffered a concussion recently, skiing in Whistler. That makes sense. Oh, yeah. Okay, that was creepy. Ow! Do not blow this for me. Hey, I've got a few expressions up my sleeve, sweetheart. Check out my I'm hotter than you stare. It looks more like you have to go to the bathroom. Yeah, I kind of do. Nice going. I could have gotten in here without your help, you know. It was a foolproof plan. How was I supposed to know he was so cheap he'd follow a dollar bill right into a climbing wall? Yeah, well, I'm going to be on probation for the rest of my life. Huh. I wonder how they remove a fish hook from a nose anyway. No! You don't understand! I'm a people person! A people person! Please, have a little <laughs> dignity, son. No! Gee, thanks! Okay, I so want to work here. Yeah, we got that.